Ready for a hunting trip to Endor? Let's see. Ten pairs of underwear, several sets of Imperial uniforms. Looks like I'm good to go. Wait, no spears, no blasters, no disruptors, no thermal detonators? What do you think you'll be hunting with? Harsh language? I'm traveling with you to spend time with you, not really to hunt with you. In fact, I don't know if I can even pull a trigger to hunt another living animal. Look, I want you to go with me to partake in something that is important to my culture and important to me. I mean, I try to play video games with you, and that's really not my thing. I mean, how many hours have I put into Overview and not complained once? <laughs> it's uh, Overwatch, not Overview. Overview, Overwatch, overrated, whatever. The point is, I spend so much time partaking in your hobby, and I want you to experience something I not only grew up with, but is still a major part of my life. So please, really give it a shot. Get it? Shot? Because we're hunting? <sighs> All right. I'll give it an honest go. Okay. Now ease the stock into your shoulder and look down the sights. With regular projectile weapons, you have to adjust for gravity and wind resistance. But at this close range, with an energy weapon, you just aim directly and shoot. Like this? Now pull the trigger. <laughs> Are, are you all right? That was amazing. Let's do it again. Not so fast. We don't hunt just for the sake of killing. We must use all the parts of the animal to not waste any of our prey. Now hunt down enough so we can have dinner. Yes, dear. Yeah, screw it. Let's have a feast. <laughs> Die, furballs. Die, you overrated talking feral teddy bears. I'll teach you to hinder the perfection that was the return of the Jedi for the sake of merchandising. <laughs> nope, nope. Hey, Chihuahua. <laughs> the irony of them being cooked on their own fire pit. You know, Ewoks are known to eat humans from time to time. Well, I just ate you first, you furballs. Wow, you are a natural at hunting. I'm so impressed. Well, I guess we found out I'm talented at more than just middle management. Well, why don't we see if you are talented in other ways as well? <laughs> How was your vacation on Endor, Starblight? Really good. I feel the trip really made me and Amy closer together. Got me in touch with my natural instincts. And I got a lot of aggression out. Hey, you want a lucky Ewok paw for good luck? Let's take a look at our Endor operation support. Oh, what the hell is this? Attacks on our soldiers by the natives have skyrocketed. They are ruthlessly butchering our troops in guerrilla warfare. What would make them act this way? After we provided them with such great gifts during our first encounters. Starblight, do you know anything about this? No. Oh, my visions were so clear. Now everything I have foreseen is a bit cloudy. Are you sure there's not going to be any liability to the Emperor's plans? They're a bunch of furry savages with sticks. Like they could really hurt our armor-clad troops armed with blasters. Not to mention our ATSTs and at least one at it on the surface. Perhaps you're right. What was I thinking? Help! We need help down here! We're being slaughtered! We need backup! But, but how? They're using rocks and spears! They're trained soldiers! What about the ATSTs? They took over one and destroyed the others! Stole one? Stole one? How'd they get in? Who would be dumb enough to let them open the hatch? Well, where's the at at? We're all dying! Help! 
What was that on the radio? <laughs> uh, nothing. It's uh, some uh, radio drama on uh, NPR. Don't you dare say a word. <laughs>